In India, criticism of the International Olympic Committee is growing ahead of this summer's games. Opponents want the committee to scrap the sponsorship of Dow Chemical Company. Dow bought Union Carbide, the company responsible for the 1984 gas leak in the city of Bhopal that has killed an estimated 15,000 to 25,000 people. Some want the Indian government to come out in opposition, and others are recommending a boycott of the Olympics. FSRN's Jasvinder Segal reports. Aslam Sher Khan is a former hockey player who won the bronze medal for India in the 1972 Munich Olympics. He also hails from the city of Bhopal. Khan, who serves as the president of the Olympian Association of India, doesn't think the International Olympic Committee should be defending Dow. I'm feeling very bad, as it is very disappointing that the organizers are siding with Dow Chemical Company. They've even refused to listen to lawful concerns about the company's sponsorship of the London Games. It is shocking to see a company refusing liability for a corporate disaster when it has civil, criminal and environmental liabilities. Survivors of the disaster still contend with disease, sickness and hardships. Some athletes, including former Moscow Olympian Gopal Saini, say Dow's sponsorship of this international event is an insult to the survivors. I condemn the decision with very hard words. If the International Olympic Association does not drop Dow as a sponsor of the London Games in spite of our repeated requests, we should boycott these Olympics. The Olympics have been boycotted in the past as a sign of protest. But Aslam Sheikh Khan does agree that a boycott is a solution. The word boycott is a very strong word and we should refrain from using it ourselves. We don't have bad relations with the United Kingdom, so why go for such a harsh decision? If the International Olympic Association doesn't review its decision, then only should we consider non-participation. Indian sports activists are demanding that Olympics officials work in accordance with the value of the Olympic movement and to understand and appreciate the feelings and sentiments of the Bhopal survivors. Olympic Art of Vinod Chasdev Singh is a leading Indian sports broadcaster and has covered nine Olympics. Being a sports person, I'll also say we should participate, but not at the cost of our national prestige. Participation means Bhopal people who are opposing, they'll be hurt. Olympics is for brotherhood, for peace. But where is brotherhood? Where are thousands of people who are killed because of this union carbide? Amnesty International called the Olympic Committee's decision a toxic legacy and the issue prompted the resignation of Merit Alexander, an ethics commissioner for the London Olympics. Writing in The Guardian, Alexander echoed the calls of many survivors demanding the Dow take responsibility and provide adequate compensation This, said Alexander, would be a true Olympic legacy. Jaswinder Sehgal, FSRN, India.